Taurus, it's Malady from Malady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of 12, 4 through 12, 11, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish, and I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you'd like a personal reading, check the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. All right. What's going on with the Taurus? Taurus, Taurus for the week of. All right. So it seems like somebody is not um, letting their, opening their heart to a situation or to a person gotta be to a person because it's a love reading so it seems like you won't open your heart to someone else or they won't open their heart to you all right what's going on with the Taurus 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 love reading 12 4 through 11 2017 all right so it seems like um there's a lot of emotion emotional um back and forth going on here we gotta see what this feeling about Taurus. All right, so it seems like you you and your feelings a lot. I just had a like a small anxiety attack, but it's just like you you full of hope right now, hope of good things to come, and it seems like you know you you just really want things to go well. All right, so it seems like. You guys, you might be dealing with a boss. You may be the boss or this person may be your boss. Or um, you may have recently lost a job, okay? Alright. Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. What is this wave of power about for the Taurus? Alright, so this is maybe a job loss. And it seems like whatever this job loss is... It's like it was for the better. You know, I feel like it was a weight lifted off of you. This job was driving you crazy. Okay. Alright, yeah. So it seems like you're hoping for somebody to open their heart to you. You're really emotional. Right now, this person isn't. Let's see why. Why is this vulnerability here for the Taurus? Okay, so it seems like they're not vulnerable for, to you. I feel like because you keep telling them to be. And it's like, it's sort of scaring them away. But this could be happening to you too. It's just like, open your heart to me, open your heart to me. And when you do that to people, it kind of scares them away. Like, why would you want this? You know, why would you, why are you trying to get me to open my heart to you? They feel like you got um, arterial motives. Okay. All right, so it seems like you may be trying to help somebody get ahead. You may be, um, you may possibly be being used by somebody, okay? Mm. Okay, so it seems like you may have lost somebody here, like... You may have been trying to get this person to open up to you. You're doing everything for this person. And it ended up taking you into a negative place. You could have worked with this person too. But I feel like this person may be the cause of you losing your job. Or, or you may be the cause of them losing theirs. Or they might just be blaming you for this. But I'm feeling a little bit of negative energy here okay so it seems like you was helping this person out and I feel like you got them to where they needed to go and then they were just thinking about you leaving you but you left them before it because they just was like too much you had to get that negative energy off of you okay all right so it seems like since you let this person go you've been sleeping better you've been eating better you know i feel like i've been i don't know why i feel the hermit right now i just feel like you're in deep thought right now 
okay? You just feel like something better is going to happen. And I feel like you got something better coming in, but it's not saying it in this book. Maybe we get it out the Cleo cards. All right. What's going on? What's going on with the Taurus, Taurus, Taurus? Sorry. What's going on with the Taurus for the week of 12, 4 through 12? 11, 2017, love reading, love reading, love reading, Taurus. What's going on with the Taurus? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on, Taurus? Taurus, Taurus. All right, so it seems like you were in a battle that you wasn't really ready for. You know, you was ready, you thought you were ready to help somebody ready to be for them and I feel like for some of you guys be there for them and, and their kids and it seems like you just couldn't do it you couldn't do it they was asking for too much too early yeah you stop fighting you're not fighting for this you don't feel like it's worth fighting for okay yeah so it seems like this person was one too much money. You was throwing all this money out there. And it seems like this person was only materialistic. Or this could be you too. This per could be um, the opposite way around. But it seems like somebody was just out for money and personal gain. And you didn't want it. So you had to give them the boot. Alright. But it seems like everything is going to work out good. If the, this, With this job loss, it seems like you are going to get a job, another job and a better job. You know, I don't know if this is you or your partner. Yeah, but I feel like new beginnings, new everything is coming up and it's going to be in victory. So your your future hopes are going to come true. All right. All right. So let's read the cards. So first we have the Knight of Swords here. Night, night, night. Want to go night, night? All right, so it says lack of strategy or confidence, self-imposed, soft sense of security. So it seems like at first you were believing that this could work and you're trying hard and doing stuff for this person. And then you're just like, no, I'm not playing no more. You know, I, I see this ain't going to work and I'm not going to make myself believe it is. All right, so now we have the nine of staffs reversed and it says... The result product of lack of planning movement will be painful and draining with little time to rest. So it seems like on what trying to help this person out, you like exhausted a lot of money or resources that you put away for yourself. And now you it's going to be hard for you to get all this back. All right. So now we got the queen of coins. And then she's reversed. So it says... Secretive, false compliment, mean-spirited, and judgmental. So, yeah, that's that negative energy. So, it seems like this person may have been manipulating you a little bit to get you to do what they wanted you to do. Okay? But it could be the other way around also, okay? So, we, now we have the Ace of Swords. And this is a notice of new birth, pregnancy, increase in family, marriage, or adoption. And relocation and this I mean I guess it could be any of those but I feel like it's, it might be relocation here and I feel like you you just going to a new better place and possibly within the next three months if pregnancy is what you want that's what it, what you'll have but it's like basically after this whole situation is done whatever you're going for you're gonna get it okay I feel like there's gonna be a lot more planning going on because you're in your mind about what's next uh but good luck to you and that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs if you want a personal reading check in the description box below email me and we can set something up other than that have a wonderful week